Hello guys, this is Pawan Kumar and you are watching RTB Studies. Have you ever thought why certain things are colored with that particular color? Or what is the science behind choosing that color? We daily see the objects with colors and make choices based on the color they bear. Like the color of book, car, poster, application, brand logo, clothes and buildings etc. We often listen that we should not judge a book by its cover but most of us do judge. And it happens automatically because our brain perceives different colors differently. Now what is the importance of colors? You must have noticed that most of the social media platforms logo have a common color like Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, LinkedIn and Skype have different shades of blue as well as the applications related to food, health and wellness also have similar type of color. Having people be in the most receptive mood is essential for their engagement with the brand and uh, Color sets the mood of the brand expression and more importantly, it creates mental association to the meaning of the brand within the context of the world it lives in. So in marketing, colors can be powerful tool uh, used to influence reactions and responses in the audience. The psychology of colors explains that specific colors can trigger certain emotions and moods in people, while some colors can trigger urgency and alertness, others can make the audience feel calm or even nostalgic. So now you got to know that every color has some uh, property which provokes various uh, psychological responses that impact human behaviors. So now before going further, if you are not familiar with the basic color theory, you can watch this video. Now let's first talk about the colors and then we will see the meanings of each color one by one. So broadly all the colors in the color wheel are divided in two parts, cool colors and warm colors. Red, orange, yellow and variations of these colors are warm colors. These are the colors of fire, fallen leaves, sunsets and sunrises. It seems as if these colors radiate warmth. Warm colors are associated with passion, energy, impulsiveness, happiness and positivity. Similarly, green, blue, violet and variations of these colors represent cool colors. So cool colors are associated with the calm, trust and professionalism. And many a times they also represent sadness and melancholy. Now let's understand the meaning of each color. So the very first color we have is red. This is one of the primary colors along with yellow and blue. If you want to draw attention, use red. It is often where the eye looks first. So red is the color of energy and it is associated with the movement and excitement. People surrounded by red find their heart beating a little faster. Red is not a color to be overused but using a spot of red in just the right place is smart in some cases like a red tie with a navy blue suit and a white shirt adds just the right amount of energy to draw attention. Red is the symbol of life and for this reason it is the color worn by brides in China and also in many parts of India. So the red color represents passion, power, strength, love, danger, violence, excitement, energy, gentle, warmth, comfort, intensity and life. Second is white. For most of the world, this color is associated with purity, that is wearing dresses and cleanliness, that is the doctors in white coats and the safety. It is also used to project the absence of colors or neutrality. So in some eastern parts of the world, white is also related with the grief. So the white color represents purity, innocence, cleanliness, emptiness, simplicity, peace, sense of space, neutrality, mourning. So third one is black. Black is the color of authority, power, stability and strength. It is also the color uh, related with the intelligence. Uh, black clothes have the property to make people appear thin. So the black color can be used to represent formal, authority, power, strength, evil, intelligence, boldness, death or mourning, mystery and sophistication. So fourth is grey. Grey is most associated with practical, timeless and solid things in life. Some shades of grey are used to represent old age, death, taxes, depression or lost sense of direction. So grey color represents neutrality, timelessness, practicality, death, taxes and depression. So fifth one is the most flamboyant color on the planet. It is the color tied with the most fun times, happy and energetic days, warmth and organic products. So the orange color represents happiness, energetic, excitement, enthusiasm, 
warmth, prosperity, stimulation, success, adventure, and creativity. So sixth one is yellow. Cheerful yellow is the color of sun linked with laughter, happiness, and good times. A person surrounded by yellow feels more optimistic because the brain actually releases chemical serotonin. So the yellow represents happiness, laughter, cheery, warmth, optimism, hunger, caution, intensity, frustration, intellect, attention getting. Seventh is green, the color of growth, nature and money. A common color also that is very pleasing to the senses. Hospitals use light green rooms because they are found to be calming to patients. It is also the color associated with envy, good luck, generosity and fertility. So the green color represents natural, cool, quality, growth, wealth, health, envy, tranquility, freshness, harmony, calmness and fertility. Eighth is blue. Most people's favorite color is blue and much of the world is blue like the skies and seas. Seeing the color blue actually causes the body to produce chemicals that are calming but that is not true for all shades of blue and sometimes the shades with too much of blue can send a cold and uncaring message. Many bedrooms are blue because it's calm, restful color. People tend to be more productive in a blue room because they are calm and focused on the task at the hand. So blue represents calmness, serenity, cold, depth, sadness, wisdom, loyalty, truth, focused and peace. So ninth is purple. This is the most royal color that is linked with the wealth, prosperity, rich and sophistication. This color stimulates the brain activity used in problem solving. Use purple color most carefully to lend the air of mystery, wisdom and respect. So this represents royalty, wealth, sophistication, wisdom, exotic, spiritual, imagination, luxury, respect and mystery. Tenth is brown. Okay, so this color is most linked with reliability, stability and friendship. More are likely to select this color as their favorite color and this also sometimes represent the things being natural or organic. So the brown color can be used to represent reliability, stability, friendship, sadness, warmth, comfort, security, natural, organic and mourning. Eleventh is pink. The color of sensitivity, the passion of red combined with the Purity of white creates this color, which is linked with the love, tranquility and femininity. Pink has association with tenderness and nurturing while conveying a sense of safety and even vulnerability. So the pink color can be used to represent romance, love, gentle, feminine, calming and agitation. So this was all about the psychology of color. I'm sure you must have learned something new from this video and okay, so if that is so, like this video share with the friends or someone who is related to any sort of design background and comment below if you have any query, suggestions or any other contrasting opinion to share. You can also follow Archive Studies in Instagram, Facebook and Telegram to receive new information related to art and architecture regularly and do not forget to subscribe to this channel to receive future updates.